you know, the Lord has given me a word and he has been speaking it and I could just see how true it is. How real it is and how valid it is. You know, I years ago it came to my mind, but now as he speaks it, it is more clear than ever. One day it is said when you are at the present situation, it hurts, it is painful, it's unfair. But then again, let me assure you, when the Lord finally comes through, you will be glad that the Everything that you ever prayed for. Every person that rejected you, but at the time you felt like, Lord, I'm ready. This is the one. Lord, I'm ready. This is the job that I want. If I can have this job and you couldn't get it and you'd be like, Lord, why you? You were depressed. You were stressed for even years to make it worse. When he finally comes through and you look back, what are the chances that if you had taken that job, that job, you would have now occupied the one that you get, you, you have now. Or you would have come up with an idea to start your own business, which is giving you more money multiple times than that job would ever do in a lifetime. That you are getting married to a person who in character and in a physical appearance is way better than the person who rejected you before. Let me tell you, when you look at it like this, you'll be even grateful. And by then, because you are over that person, you'll even be glad that, oh, I almost made a mistake. I can't believe I was ready to commit forever. That is how God operates. You cry today and say, why, Lord? But he knows that tomorrow you're going to thank him. In fact, you'll be, you'll be like, I'm glad, Lord, you did not listen to my cry that time. It is said at the moment, you have to just be strong. That's the thing. It's said that you just have to be strong, but it is good because the result or at the end is going to be worth it. You'll be glad that, yes, that disappointment. Oh, I'm go. Oh, I can't believe it. I almost made a big mistake. And at the time, I felt like I don't care what you, you have in store in the future. This is what I want. But now you'll be like, oh, wow. Thank you, Jesus. I pray for you. Let God's spirit enable you in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. And of course, that's all I had. My details are on the comment section below. See you next time.